Well, you often do not get to see the people behind the scenes at the Louisiana Department of Agriculture and Forestry, who have dedicated most of their careers to protecting the ag and forestry industries. Today we meet Lester Cannon, who is the Department of Ag and Forestry's Seed Programs Director. He and his team inspect sugarcane seed fields in Point Capete Parish and take us through the process of ensuring the quality of this important commodity. It's just one of the many things the LDAF does to support the industry. We're actually in um, one of our sugarcane fields here in, in Point Capete Parish. And what the reason we're here, because this is part of the Louisiana Seed Certification Program. Prior to the establishment of this program, as with any commodity, the sugarcane industry was experiencing some, some really economic losses, in particularly from diseases. So the ag professionals got together with LDAF in an attempt to establish this program to provide a clean seed, virus-free seed for the commercial sugarcane industry. So we got together and we established a program to, to try and help prevent these diseases. So you've got some 183 and of course the- They the, apply uh, for these uh, fields to be inspected by us through our certification program. And we inspect them a minimum of three times a year throughout the growing period. There's two new varieties that's, that has been released into the industry which is 804, and the newest one that was released or due to release this year, 183. We have a new problem that LDF inspectors have to look for now. So we're paying particular attention to mosaic in these two particular varieties. You always want new varieties, and that's what's so important uh, with this industry right now. You know, there are really and truly four varieties, one being like far better than the rest of them. And in other uh, crops that we grow, soybeans, you can have 100 varieties. In sugarcane, you're, we're limited. It takes years and sometimes even decades for a variety like this to be released. They started crossing this 10 years ago or more. We've had it happen. You, you get a variety and you plant it and it ended up not producing like we wanted to. It didn't make money. And so it's so important to get this research done ahead of time so when we do plant them, we got a chance. And you just want to keep the cleanest seed out there. And we, they have been doing that. Sugarcane is a major crop for Louisiana, and, and it's, it's expanding here in Louisiana. And we don't want to get in a situation that we were decades ago. Um, because, you know, with, with the amount of sugar cane that's in this area, some of these diseases and problems will pop up and it could spread. We want to ward off any problems while it's in this stage on a half of acre before it gets out there and it's in thousands of acres. Certified crops are held to a higher standard to ensure quality of the product and go through a more thorough inspection process. Still to come on Twyla, we take you to Alexandria for all the sights and sounds from the FFA convention. And speaking of the next generation, we'll learn about students teaching each other valuable life skills. Stay with us.